What is going on, guys? Sports 23 here, bringing you another patrol. Um, sorry, it's been a couple weeks. Oh, I got traffic backed up. I've um, been kind of not really crazy busy, but I've had things I've had to take care of. Even though I still have been in the house um, a bit more than usual, um, I still am working here and there, so it wasn't all fun and games. But um, I hope you guys enjoy this. We're in this unmarked. Uh, vehicle. I should have a link in the description. It's from the New York Police Department pack. And we are currently heading to a, a vehicle fire. So we'll go head over there. Um, this is from one of the newer call-out scripts that I installed. It has a nice variety of calls, so it's been pretty fun to mess around with. Might change the time. Like afternoon. That's better. Easier to see. So we'll head over there, and um, I've had a couple of these calls so far. So usually we get on scene, and then we have to call the fire department. So this looks like it's on the highway. All right. Supposedly that vehicle's on fire. Yes, it is. And, um... I have a couple mods that are overlapping each other. So that's kind of annoying. And I'm gonna have to fix that. I believe there's a... Oh, boy. There's a fire extinguisher. So let's get out and help him. Well, yeah. They're using fire extinguishers too. I may as well help. So this vehicle kind of just blew up. It's a good thing no one's in it. All right, fire appears to be out. So, and this call out. I don't know where the operator went. I guess he just decided to leave. But we'll get back in our vehicle. And we'll see if we can clear this so it's no longer a uh, hazard. Okay, cool. And we're done with that. So what have you guys been up to? Where where are you from? And are you guys opening up after this um, first kind of wave of the pandemic? So like... Do you guys live in Texas and you guys are still locked down or try to let me know what uh, what the latest is from where you live. I think it seems most states are opening up at least in phases and they're starting to kind of gradually open different things up like barbershops and things like that. Um, and I say first wave of the pandemic, I don't know for sure whether or not there's going to be a second, but who knows? I think it's going to be a different way of living for a little bit, for maybe um, more than a little bit. I think it's kind of going to be the, like they say, the new normal for a little while, unfortunately. Obviously, some people would like to get back to exactly how things were previously, but maybe there's an even better way of life. Obviously not the masks and gloves all the time people getting sick and dying part but just improvements made overall because not everything previously was perfect even though we didn't have to worry about the coronavirus necessarily as much as we do now or at all anyway let's see here we're available for calls I'm recording this on Saturday night um, probably upload it Saturday night. We'll see. What time is it? It's like 8.30. I don't know if I had this, um... I'm not sure if I had the, sp the speedometer mod installed last episode. In the bottom right of the screen. So that's kind of cool. Uh, Alright, we'll just take this call. I'm going to do a raid. So we'll head over there, meet with the task force. And how was your weekend, guys? What did you do? Let me know what you kept busy with. 
it was uh, yesterday, I think, was... Yeah, yesterday was a year since I got my cat, so that was cool. Before I had my cat, I actually adopted a dog. I got a puppy, but it didn't really work out as planned. Don't have him anymore. Her. I don't have her anymore. Um, but yeah, that was interesting. She was a plot hound. Okay. I don't know if any of you know much about dogs or that breed, but she was a puppy. She was relatively small, but for, for her breed, I guess. She was still growing, obviously. But she was like 20-something pounds, and obviously she was going to get a lot bigger. It wasn't really the size, necessarily, that didn't work out. It was just, oops, wrong way. Just, uh, yeah, I don't know. If any of you have a puppy or have had a puppy, they're a handful. Cats are a lot easier in many ways. So we're going to meet with this uh, task force for a raid of some sort. I guess it works out that we're in a... Okay, my bad. We're in an unmarked car. All right, I don't think I've had this call out yet. This is the task force, this one vehicle. How's it going? Yeah, the gangs have become really aggressive around here. Oh, they murdered a police officer. It's a large scale raid. All right, so you set up a large scale raid and there's only three of us. I'm in charge. Oh. Okay, calling in the raid team. All right, uh, follow me, guys. I guess the raid team will meet us there. All right, let's see what this is about. I have not done this one yet. I'm assuming it's going to end in a shootout. Where are we on the map right now? Got it. We'll just wait for traffic. No need to call attention to ourselves. Where's the uh, marked cruiser? Man. Oh boy. And we're getting shot at. They don't know our... That's not even the right people. That was a guy that got, that had like road rage, like that got out of a car. All right, we died. That was like someone that just got out of a car and that was random that he was armed. I don't think that was associated with this call out. Okay, well, I should have taken cover there. Um, I don't think the call's still on the map. I'm not sure. Do calls disappear once you are done with it? Regardless, we'll move on from there. So we'll see what other calls we get. Not gonna take the robbery. Does anyone actually leave the radio on in this game? It's pretty annoying. We're not doing that call again. Sanitation transport. Nope, don't need another car fire. Alright, we'll take this one. Prisoners have escaped per the Department of Corrections. All right, we're a little bit away, so put our siren on. I've had this call out, I think once, when I was just messing around. So we'll head over there, see if we can help out. The lights don't look too great right now. I might have to experiment with another, uh, graphics mod. For some reason, I thought I had a different one than I actually believe I have installed. Um, the one I have is from back when I played LSPDFR maybe a year ago. So it was already downloaded on my computer and I just reinstalled it. And 
it's not the one I thought I was using. If that makes sense. But it does a decent job. The game looks better than it did just right out of the box. The lights don't look too great, though. It might be because I didn't install the uh, corresponding, like, ELS file for the vehicles. I may have for some of them. I don't remember. It's hard to remember all the little things you do when you're modding a game. But we're about a mile and a half out from this call, so we're getting there. Going 109 miles an hour, which is a little bit too fast. But reasonable, I guess, for the situation. And I've been trying to look up ways to connect my PlayStation controller to my PC because driving with the steering wheel is not ideal. I didn't realize we got here so quick. So they stole... Oh, wait, what? Oh, they're down there. So it's telling me that they stole a vehicle of some sort. Go catch up and see if we can handle this. I should probably call in some backup. Oh, are they shooting? I could have swore I just heard a gunshot. Okay, well I can't perform a traffic stop. All right, let's get a, an air support unit. unit. We have units requesting helicopter support over Grande Sonora Desert. All right, we'll get up ahead of them and try to um, Eagle four, we have use the spike anyway. strips, which we'll just use a um, firearm. Use a shotgun. Get it. All right, I think that did something to their car. Okay, I guess we'll try that again, because... Okay. Screw you. So, they're giving up. This guy's on foot. Call some backup. Probably switch to my taser momentarily. Sir, you better stop. You're going to regret this. If I was playing by myself here, I probably would... Nah, I wouldn't shoot him unless I was just not caring what I was doing, but. All right, get me the taser. Isn't this, mm. is this a prison? Is he running towards the prison? The place that he just escaped from? One of the more interesting things I've seen. Bro, you're gonna run into the tower, first of all. Uh, bought me a second. Could probably tase him by now. Wasn't sure of the range. Stay down. Stop what you're doing right now. Now get down. All right, we got this guy. Stand up, dude. Let's check him for weapons real quick. A flashlight's a weapon. Sit down. Okay. We, have an officer we got transport coming for him. Let's head back to the scene and see who's still there. There were quite a few people in the van, the truck thing. Looks like the car's still there. We'll see about the suspects. The helicopter's still overhead, so... You'd think they would advise us if there was any change, such as them running. It's a pretty long foot pursuit. But we're almost back. All right, let's get our pistol out. Prepare for whatever's about to come. All right, let's see. I wonder if there's a way to get them all out. Easily. 
All right, everybody get out one at a time. Put your hands up. Don't make me use this. Get on the ground. You know what? I probably should have my gun out, but just because it's harder to switch in this game. LSPD, I'm going to keep my taser out. Get down. Get up. Check this guy for weapons. Knife. Okay. Sit down. Let's see who else we have in here. I could just drive him back to the to the prison. Get out. Don't run, you're gonna get tased. Get down on the ground. Get down on the ground. Get down. You don't need to lie on top of him. Eh, whatever works. Okay, this guy's in cuffs. Check him for weapons. Should probably get the other guy out first. Get down. How many pairs of cuffs do you carry, officer? Pat him down. Hand sanitizer, nightstick. Okay, sit down. Get out. Get down. Don't run. All right, we got all of them apprehended. No one hurt. Nobody uh, killed. Nobody escaped. I would say that's a success. All right, we'll call a transport unit for them. And uh, I'm going to call that an episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, that was actually pretty fun. I had a good time. This was a pretty interesting call. Glad we were able to su successfully resolve it. There's one guy up there. We'll just assume that transport picked him up. Once transport comes and takes these four, I don't know, can they put them all in one car? I guess we'll see. All right, so let's clear up traffic a bit. I'll move my car out of the road. Well, out of that part of the road. And let's see who they take, and we'll move the police bus. We'll bring it back to the prison when we're done, if we can. Thank you, guys. Yeah, just these four. The other guy was already taken, I think. Oh, look at that. They got four transport units. Awesome. All right. We are going to move our car off the road. Lock it up. Hop in the police bus. Oh, cool. This is an ELS bus. All right, so we will drive this back to the... Wow, that drives slow. Oh, yeah. I shot the tires out. That's right. We'll bring this up to the prison. Might need to just fix the tire. Nah, we'll make it. It's a cool interior. Looks like the scene's clear. They've all been picked up. Transport, bring them back up here. That would have been funny if they just all surrendered and then I just drove them back in their own truck that they stole. All right, so we're crawling here. Not sure if we're going the right way. Yeah, I don't, the exit's on the other side. I'm not going to bother with that. We'll just call it an episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe if you haven't. And um, All units, we have an ambulance we'll see you guys in, in the uh, next episode. Large uh, truck tipped now. over. I have not had yeah, that call yet, so stay tuned. Perhaps in the next episode we'll be able to handle that. Take care, guys.